Hi guys, it's Rachel here. I think I'm up to, I'm still making ephemera for this. I did did those, um, to be honest, last week and um, I did a few videos because I was inspired. So, so I've got all my ephemera, I just stitched it, it's under the book because it had curved a little bit in this container. Um, so I just want to see where I'm at because um, I think it might be, I'm going to be doing 6B because I think I need to make more ephemera, but I can't even remember what I did here. And I need to put my book under under some heavy books as well. So that way, um, these are my glue pages. Let's have a look. They haven't really flattened. Oh no, that one doesn't go there. That's, well, it could, but it's that's from one of the challenges. So um, I've just stitched around them. That's all I've done. Whoops, the, the cord is getting in my way. Um, so I just want to see where am I going to put things. Is that going to be a problem there? Not really, but anyway, let's have a look. Let's see how we're going. I think I prefer this, and then I'll put something else. Now, I could change my mind. I still have to work here, so we'll do that. And I might work on some of the pages, um, but I just do want to see. Oh, that's that. I keep getting confused with that. No, it is an envelope. I didn't open it. Ha! Huh, that's what the problem is. Okay, so I might, I might, um, well, I'll open it on the side because, um, hopefully I'm on screen. I'll open it on the side because I'm going to put a tag in the bag that it's attached to. It's a good idea to remember, bad scissors, let's get the good scissors. Good idea to remember to do this job before you attach it to the book. After many goes, I have done it. It's like it's like seeing something new. There, you see, it is a it is a pocket. I don't know that I've got anything that will go in there. So, um, as I said, I've stitched everything. Uh, I just want to see my tags. I think I might put that one in there. It's same. Yeah, I like that. And oh, I could put something like that in there. and have it poking out. That's a good idea. Now, is that going to be a problem? No, I like that. It's like having a tab. So that's good. And we'll just start filling some pockets. What was this? This is a tuck. Um, I probably need more journaling cards. That one's way too big for there. Oh, no, it's not. It is. Yes, it's way too big. And it's the same design, so I don't want to put that one in there. So for that one, I might have to... Oh, that's going to be pretty. No, I'll make something for that one. So maybe I should write it down as I go. Um, what do I need? I'll just grab a piece of scrap paper here. So I'll put journaling card JC one. Although you could put a letter in there. You don't have to. Oh, here we go. Now what do we have got? What's going to go in there? I would love it if that fit in there, but it doesn't. No. So I need something for there, but I can certainly put one of these in here as well. And I actually do like the mushrooms. Um, I just didn't, I was just wondering whether they really um, went. Now I do have a pocket behind, but I don't think I'm going to use it because um, it's on an old piece, old book page. And so, um, so I need a journaling card for there and I don't want it to be more than... I need about a 10 centimetre wide, 10 centimetre wide journaling card for there. And then what else do we have? Oh, I haven't opened that. I might put some ephemera in there. So then we've got this lovely pocket here. And what would I like to see in there? So I've got quite a lot of little um, journaling cards, but not many big ones. Oh, that's not a pocket. There we go. See, I can't even remember what I did. Now, if I had washi tape, I would put a little bit of washi tape there. But I don't. Oops. Okay, let me see here. No pocket. Oh, here's a belly band. Oh, it's got this. Maybe I'll put... I think I'd like to see this one in there. There we go. Oh, isn't that pretty? Oh, I love that page. Yummy. Okay, and then here, um, 
So I need some more big journaling cards. That, oh, that's nice in there, isn't it? I like that, and it fits better. You see, it's not going to bother me. And I'll decide about that, what I want to do with that. Um, here I've got another belly band. So what I can do here is, like, I could slip that there. And then I could get some old letter and slip that behind. Oh, I could, maybe I'll slip, I was going to attach, I was just going to clip that, I think I'm going to slip that in there, and I'll put an old letter in there. That's what I'm going to do, I'm going to slip that behind there like that. Okay, gosh, it's like, um, I can't even remember what I was going to do. So, I might put, that's pretty in there, maybe we'll put that and that one. No, I think, do you know what I would like? So I have tied it up a little bit. Um, I'm just going to slide that across here. I've got my, I've got my box in. I just, you know, everything's going to fall down. So I'm just going to have to bring it over. I put everything, you know, back in its folder as it was on my table. Um, before I went, before I went away. But I did tidy up the box a little bit. I've also got this book here. I thought I might like to put something like that, but I think I've got a bigger one. Just a minute, I did tidy up, so I have to just find that I put all these um, these book pages together, so that way I could, here we go, I'd like to put things like that in, that I kept coming across when I was using my glue book, just put those there. So I think what I'll do is I'll tear this down, because you don't have to put, um, it's just a nice place to collect all things that you like, I'm just going to take off that edge if I can. Um, I need to take off this edge as well I think because it's going to be too wide. I'm just tearing it down. It's very fragile paper. I love the image. Mascara della Puccinella. And then there's a lovely image on the other side. So I think I'll slip that in the pocket behind the tag. Yeah. Oops, let's take the tag out. I shouldn't wear my woolly jumpers when I'm working because they get in the way. They re Oh, isn't that wonderful? Maybe I'll change my tag just a minute. Oh, I think I like that one more. Yeah. Okay. So, yep, just, just checking where I'm at. So I need another journaling card for there. Where's my list here? So I need three journaling cards, another journaling card. Um, and I could slip, not that one, this one in there as well. And I might, you know, put other things. I'm going to decorate that page. Oh, here we go. Now we've got a lot going on here. Um, did I open? No, that was just the journaling card, that one. It's stuck down. Oopsie. Oh, no, it's not. What a ding dong. Oh, I love that. I forgot about that. So where did I open this one? I think I opened it at the top, right? Well, that's a good spot for this tag, I think, because it's a nice long one. And it'll poke out the top. There we go. So that's going to go in there, and I don't think I have to put anything else in there. I've got to get this jumper out of the way. It's getting hooked onto everything. It's driving me bananas. I don't want to drive me bananas because then I go cray cray. Oh, and if you can hear any noise, um, it's a public holiday in San Marino today. So Stiffy's at home, and he's got his um, music stuff. He's got doing something on the thing. Oh, I forgot about that lovely envelope. Isn't that nice? So we'll put something in there, and then of course here you can put anything that you want. So I think I might like to make something a little bit exciting to go in there. So let's find a spot for these. I'm gonna, I don't think I'll put a tag, I think I'll put some booklet or something. So we've got a tag in there. Um, well, I could have two tags here, I don't like that. And then I'll make a journaling card for that, as I said. And then, Well, we could have, well, I don't actually know what I can do, but I did like that there. Well, what I can do here, actually, rather than making a journaling card, I've got 
these book pages. There aren't they pretty? So maybe I think I'll tear this one down and just slip that in there. So in this video, we don't need to make too much. We're finishing things, well, finishing off the ephemera and maybe um, might have time for a bit of um, decoration. Very bad tearing. Very bad tearing, and I think I might. I think I might have to get my, my scissors. That's probably a better idea. I'm making a terrible mess of it. I don't want to lose all those edges. Okay, that's better. Right. So I think I'm going to put that in there. And I might put that tag there. Move that one up there. That's better. Yes. Okay. Then, got this here. That's okay. I know I had empty space somewhere. That's okay there. Okay, so I can open this. Although I think I might open it. I might open this. Let me just see the other side of it, how wide it is. I've got that in there. That's okay. Um, that's good there. That's for writing. That won't, won't fit in there. Okay, so I open this one. I'm just going to turn it around because I am a lefty. I have to turn it upside down so that way I can go this way. And I'm not going to go right to the corner just to here and yeah probably a good idea to do this sort of thing before you put the pages in but I wasn't quite sure how I wanted to proceed with it And then I can get this. Actually, if I just go like this, I can see that way as well. Okay. Or is this episode seven? I can't remember. I do forgive me. I just can't remember. And that's a nice wide pocket for that fluffy bit of lace to pop in there. There we go. So I don't need too much. I just need a few more, a couple more journaling cards. That's very happy there. Although that, no, I do like that. It's very pretty. I like those together. Um, okay. Let's go make something for that. And there. Well, I don't have to make anything for there. I could. I've got another one of these pages. I love these. I'm just going to tear off the very um, bad tearing I did out of the book. And then. We won't lose the writing, we'll keep that. So I think that this project is nearly done. And put that one in there, cute. Is there anything else we want to put in there? Oh, look at this. How wonderful is that? Of those. Um, I like all these images as well. I've been really into these. Okay. Okay, let's make something. Oh, I know what would be good. That, that's the burning of Savonarola. And he, oh, when was he? He was a 
Oh, I think he was in the 1500s. And he, um, he pur you know, he purged all of the books. Um, you know, he said they're all against the church and the Medici and all that sort of thing. And he, um, and, but anyway, then the Florentines rebelled against him. But he did, he did a lot of damage. A lot of um, important works were lost. I think I'll keep that. That's a nice piece of paper to make something out of. So I'll keep that. And I'm actually just going to fold this and put it in somewhere. I think it was 15. Uh, where are you going, Steffi? Oh, to get Lulu. Yeah. Thank you. Do oh, well, you better drop her off because you know she has yeah, to study. Yeah. Thank you, Steffi. I do the shopping. Okay, do you need something? Okay. Oh, I wrote a list. It's by the computer. Thank you. So we've got um, Steffi's mama and papa and auntie coming over for dinner tonight. So um, that won't fit in there. So um, he's been. We've been. We've done a big tidy up. Big well, you know, Steph's mum doesn't mind my mess. She's used to me, but. Um, you know, we wanted to tidy up for his aunt coming. And um, so they're coming for dinner because Steph's at home today. So he's... Oh, look what's happening. Be, uh, why now? Oh, I see. So, oh, well, that, that comes off. Well, I might glue that back down because I like that being there. I'm going to slip that in there. I think I feel every... I don't... Probably don't... Oh, it's upside down. Yep, so they're coming over for dinner. So um, we've done a big tidy up and... It's nice having him here because he's doing all of the errands for me. I'm like, you know, picking Lulu up from volleyball and he went to the courier for me to drop off an order and it's just wonderful. Isn't that great? Mind you, I did I couldn't work this morning. I had to tidy up all my mess because otherwise it would have been 21 questions. Where does this go? Where does that go? What do I do with this? So I thought, well, I might as well just bite the bullet and get up and get organised. And I did tidy up my desk as well. So we'll, um, so um, one uh, lady has asked if could I show how I organise myself. And um, so I'm just flipping through again just to see. Probably don't need. I actually don't need to make any more, I don't think. Um, I might make one or two. Oh, yes, I do. I need to make the one thing. Okay, so let's get that done. Um so I need to, then I need to also think about the closure. Let me just, oh no, I've got stuff here. I've got stuff here. So how long is this index card? Oh, isn't that nice? It's 12. No, I don't want to tear that down. We'll use this and it needs to be 10. So 10 centimetres is about there after 1734. I'm just eyeballing it, really. I kind of measured it but just looked at where, what word it sort of ended on. And I don't like the proportion of that, so I'm going to make it a bit shorter. There we go. I like that more. I need to get my goodies out. I've got that big mess still there in that basket. That hasn't been sorted, but every, I'm getting cold. I'm pulling my sleeve back down now because I'm getting cold. Um, let me see. Let me see. And I'll be publishing this video on Friday. Oh, something like that. Ooh. Something like that could be nice. Just let me have a look at my goodies in here. Here it all comes out again. Um, see, that one would be cute in there. I don't think I've made one with the penguin. Um, the penguin. <laughs> goodness I can't believe I just said that it's not a penguin what is it it's a seagull oh my goodness what a goose sorry guys it's not a penguin it's a it's a seagull oh, I love all of these I just want to use them all okay I won't I won't like bore you all to tears going through all of that I think I've decided on the seagull not the penguin I'm going to tear it put that over there hopefully not everything falls down Okay. Hey. 
Oh, and I know I said I wanted to make something fun to go in the back. So in the in the back pocket, I think in that envelope, I'm going to put some. It's going to be a very simple little journaling card. Um, I want to put some. What do you call them? Maybe a letter or something in there. So let's glue this. Where's the glue box? Yes, so I think I was saying, I don't know if I finished, excuse me if I repeat myself, that um, I was asked, um, how do I organise myself? So I directed um, the person who asked to my, sorry, I can't remember. I should have, I, my, I do try to write down names now because I've got a memory like a sieve, but I did forget um, because I've got a memory like a sieve. Um, yes, so I did direct her to my craft room video because um, that does, I, I think I did show a bit in there like how I, where I put things. Um, but I think I'd like to show a little bit. I did tell her it was ever changing, um, you know, as I feel like there's something better, another better way, you know, because I get into a mess and then it's not working for me anymore. So then I try and try something else. I, I don't know if anybody else is like that, but it's just an eternal mess. Um, so, yeah, so we'll put a little bit of textile or something there just to make it a bit more interesting. Um, yes, so I did direct her to um, watch that video, and um, but I will show how I've sort of tidied up my table. Uh, well, tidied up my table. That's a that's a stretch. That is a stretch. It's not really tidy. It's just um, I tidied up the yeah, I like that. I tidied up the um, the box where I have all this stuff in it. I sort of um, divided it a little bit better the stuff because it was just if if you don't have a I think one of the biggest things to take from this is that everything needs to have a spot so um, if it doesn't have a spot so we just have to stitch that I'll just put that over there now let me just well let's just have a look how it's going to look in the pocket if everything has a spot then you then it's much easier to stay a little bit more organized I think that one's going to go there I need to find my, hopefully I'm on screen, I think I made it very mini, that when I, I will go in better when I've stitched it, I'm probably totally off screen, I'll move it in a second, we just have to wait, I'm going to put a tab on the top, there we go, it's crooked, there we go, see, that little journaling card, it's going to pop in there with the little seagull peeking out, there we go, so I need to put a tab on there. So we'll do that. And did I need anything else? I know I wrote down things. Um, I might put something big in there as well. What do I have that could go in there? That might be nice. That would fit. We'll have a look in a second. We will look in a second. Oh, something like that. Aren't they beautiful? These are these wonderful... Um, I'd like to make a journaling card out of that too. Um, these are these wonderful um, sort of Italian sort of travel books that you can buy at the antique markets. I mean, they're not that old. They're from the, I don't know when, 60s. I think I had one from the 30s. I think I've, I've divided that one up and sent that out in paper parcels. Um, but um, they are great. You can, it's a good way to get lots of images of Italy, and it's 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 like a matte sort of paper. It's not really overly glossy, which I really like. And I think it's nice just to put some of these things in here because this is a very Italian journal. It's a bit bright on that side. I think I'll put the, that side on. The, in there and then you can turn it over and see the other. I like those colors more okay so the next thing I have to do is and then we'll go through again and see I need to do this now this is going to be a bit of a challenge isn't it because um, 
it's going to be quite hard to 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 oh well, I guess I'll glue over there so maybe so oh I think I like that there I know it's meant to be for writing isn't it well you, well, you don't necessarily need to write there do you right it would be a very difficult spot to write I think I'm going to stick that there my issue is okay I'm going to eyeball it I don't, you probably couldn't even see. I'm probably totally off screen. Yep, I think I was. Sorry, guys, don't scream at me. Very sorry. Apologise. Now that, mm, now that's not straight, is it? <laughs> Let's put this on the line there. Okay. Hopefully I haven't done it too wide. This over here. Yes, I'm on the screen. I was going to put it there. Yes, it's good. And I need to take the bottom off. I'm going to keep that jagged edge at the top that says Firenze. And I'm just going, oh, I want to go to Florence. I'm just going to tear off this bottom bit. There we go. So Lulu wants to go, well, at the moment, her plan is, is she would like to, better start saving for it, she would like to um, go and study architecture in Florence, just like her dad did. Uh, I don't know, I think she's just enamoured, well, Florence is lovely, but she's enamoured with it because that's where we met and her dad studied there and that sort of thing. So, um, yep, so we'll have to help her pay her rent there and that sort of thing. I mean, the university is a bit like in Australia, you sort of pay um, taxes for the university, university taxes, but it's not, you don't pay college fees or anything like that. There we go. And then if someone wanted to do writing on there, you could um, put a little patch on there that you could write and now I haven't stuck that down, didn't get enough glue. That's not very good. Well, that's just not, that's just no good at all. I'll just do it this way, see if I can get more glue on there. I should have done it before. Um, yes, yeah, so that's her plan. She'd like to go and study architecture. She'd like to be an interior designer, but in Italy you study architecture to be an interior designer. I don't know if I told you that before. And um, she's more be more like an interior architect, I think. Is what the more that's what the Italians call them. Um, and then we thought. We, 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 if, if things stay as they are in Italy, as far as work is concerned, we would encourage her to go and at least have her first work experience in Australia. And she fancies, she fancies going living with her uncle in um, Brisbane if he's still there. I don't know why she fancies that, but she does. Um, and so I just thought we might do a little bit of decorating here and there. Um, yes, so, and then I, and then she said, oh, but I might fall in love with an Italian. And I said, oh, well, if you fall in love with Italian, you'll just have to take the Italian with you. Because, um, because, you know, it just might be your better prospects might be having a job in Australia. Just looking at this little book here, isn't it cute? Oh, I've got that little journaling card I've got to stitch as well. So just, I don't know. I don't even know. If it was a good idea to turn my camera on today because I don't know what I'm thinking. Oh, I know. Do I know? No, I don't think I do. Um, I've got some ruffle. Do I want to put some ruffle anywhere? I could put a little bit of um, antique hemp. Might be nice. I put, you know, like it would have been even good to um, sort of stitch that on the machine before beforehand but the mind did not get that far so let I don't want to pull everything out of my my you know thing because I just get into a big mess I'm just going to leave a bit of it there to see if I've got anything here that I want to use um, I could 
but the, I mean, these are on, I could tear up some of these. These are all on um, regular copy paper. That's on regular copy paper. I think I was just testing them when I printed them out. These ones are stronger ones. Oh, there's some. That's a beautiful, um, that's one of those registers from my, that my mother-in-law brought for me to scan and um, just lovely texture. I mean, lovely marbled cover is what I want to say. Sorry, I'm just concentrating on looking, flicking through here very quickly. Not sharing with you at all because I'm not a very nice person. Um, and just flicking through to see if there's anything else they're all on paper because so if I'm just thinking I might just sort of tear them up a little bit and um, I'm going to stick I think more with my Italian ones the Italian themed ones rather look they're all on prop copy paper none of them are on um, what do you call it cardstock but they could just be nice oh look how many <laughs> Just, oh my god, how many times do you can you print something? Oh, they're nice. How many times can you print stuff up? Honestly. Honestly, Rachel. Hey, KB. Yes, so that's what Lulu's thinking. And I'm thinking, well, that's a great idea. And that if she wants to, maybe I would like. I'm actually, I am going to tear these. I'm not even going to make them into tags. I could regret this. Well, I'm not going to regret it. I can print them up again. There's no regrets. No regrets. Um, yes, she'll just have to take the Italian boy with her, if there is one, and and they may and the, and their mama won't be very happy. That's all. That's what will happen. Um, so I thought I could put something like. I don't want to cover up that nice. I might flip it over. Sorry, guys. I guess I like it more over here. Could do it on there. No, I'll do it here. Sorry. And I'm just trying to see, do I want... Well, I think I'll glue that down. That's a definite. So I'll just put this piece of paper here. And I've got to get a lot of glue on. Yes, so that's her plan. And then I just said, well... Well, you know, when we're old and more grey than what we are, what we are now... Um, if Lulu's living out back out there, well, then we'll have to head out and head on out there. Okay, so that's going there. I need to move these. The I, I've had, uh, one of my recommendations is don't work with these fluffy jumpers because I am they really are driving me bananas. It's getting caught on everything. I'm just trying to see my little basket of goodies. I did stitch up some, I had took, you know, I sort of tidied it up, I think I mentioned that the other day, and I did um, stitch some ruffles. Just thought a little bit of ruffle might be nice there. Yes. There, or, or down, maybe there, or across there, maybe over here, over there. I like it over there. So I, I don't, I can't obviously stitch it now because the pages are, the pages are in. So we're doing finishing touches, aren't we? We're doing, fin well, maybe this is episode part seven, I think, because we're doing finishing touches on everything. That's what we're doing, finishing touches. Just a bit of embellishing on pages and um, so I really did make enough ephemera the other day. Well, that's good because I thought I might have to make more stick that down and it's got the stitched look and I did want to put something else over here I don't want to leave that like that I think I might put a tab talk about all over the place I am really all over the place here's some tea dyed vintage cotton just from one of those um, embroidered embroidered bits but I don't want it that big I don't think um, that I've you know cut up and used and and then I just have bits left over I think I'd like to put something like that there 
No, I don't. But indecisive Rachel here today. I like that one. I think I like this colour more. I think the other one was blending in too much. Put it down. Put it there. Yeah. So I'm going to have to get a nice amount of just um, some PVA glue on there. PVA glue, for those who don't know, is just a white glue. And it's good for everything. You can even glue wood. It glues fabric, wood, everything. It's inexpensive. And I like it. So what I'll do is I'll just grab that. Get this big fluffy jumper out of the way. There. And I'll just turn it over. And that will stay. That will be fine. Would have been better, as I said, to stitch it. But thinking about things afterwards. Okay. What else is going on? Hmm. I can feel a cold breeze coming from somewhere. My husband's had the, the windows open. He's been freezing me all day. I think he thinks it's highly entertaining freezing me. Uh, I kind of would like to put something there, but I don't know what. It's very windy outside. I don't know what Lulu will come flying in. She's got to study. Oh, maybe that's nice there because it's ripped. You see? Well, maybe I'll just leave it and someone can do some collaging on there. Oh, why don't I? I need to think of a tab for this. What will I use? Oh, I like that one. That one. Nope. One nope. Oh, well, I, oh, maybe I'll go back to the other one. I think I'll use this one. Okay, so I'll just cut a piece of this off. Oops. Fold it in half. And I'll quickly stitch that so it's done. And I'll put it in its spot. Now, as I said, I did, and so with this punch, for those of you who don't know, I learnt this from Barbara from 49 Dragon Fry, Fries, Flies, um, is you don't just put it right up flush there and that way it'll be double. Look at this. See? So you don't cut it. And I'm going to put that there. So I'll, excuse me while I just pop over here to my sewing machine. Um, I'll just put the zigzag on. My um, zigzag is little, so it's taking a while to get around it. Okay. Oh, just a minute. I'm sorry. I have to go and open the door. Oh, sorry, guys. I do apologise. It was Lulu. Oh, you heard me. She heard me talking. Did you think I, I was? Talking to someone. Oh, she thought somebody was here. Yeah. Okay. In your hop. That goes in there. You see? There we go. Isn't that cute? There we go. So that's in there. Um, do you want to put anything else on any pages? So Steffi, um, as I've mentioned before, has been working, has worked on some new stuff and it's actually ready. I just have to um, put the files into a PDF file. Excuse me, Mummy. Yes, Lily. Are there any nacho chips left from last night? Oh, no, no, I used them all. Oh, okay. I did use them all. No. Um, yes, so I just have to prepare them. 
and then um, and then and then they'll be ready to go. I'll be able to share them. I think I like this here. Right, then I'd have to put no. I need to put something there, don't I? What can I do here? Well, I'll put that there. I was I liked this here. So I'll just glue it very well, but then I'll have to put something on the other side. I'll show you why. Okay. So that's on there. That's going there. And then, see, it's all white on that side. So I need to put something on that side. I have a bit of this. It's all ripped. That could be yes. Why don't I put that there? That'll solve that problem. And that's on tea or coffee dyed paper. So yeah, just a little bit of embellishing. I don't normally embellish um, the pages in the journals. Um, when you know if I'm selling them I haven't decided what I'm doing with this one yet so that's that and then do we want anything else oh I was I forgot about these things didn't I I wouldn't mind this one. Just very carefully tearing it. So that's another way you can use your tags is as embellishments. Now where would I like to put this? I think I like it there. Get plenty of glue. I haven't been putting enough glue on. Okay. Oh, I like that. And let me just go back to the beginning. I'm sorry. Just bear with me. I'm a little bit all over the place today. So I've got that. I think I might like to do a little bit of a collage thing there. I'm just thinking just popping into my mind right now I think I'm going to get this one here I think I like the thing I like about using these little tags too for this sort of thing too they've got different um, you know decorations on them as opposed to the papers and so getting you know more bang for your buck so i'm just going to fold that so that's going to be used for making a tag or something and i'm just i know i'm, I'm off screen with the um with the gluing but i can't fit it all on screen because the journal is so big so i'm going to put this here hope it works because then it's going to be there isn't it put that there and then over here i saw already cut out I did see a flower somewhere so I do need to tidy up that basket because this mess is just making me oh there's a, a birdie um, it's making me crazy there was a flower cut out already there was maybe there wasn't some greenery Some blue sky butterflies. Oh, here it is. I don't know if I want this one though. No, no, I don't want that one. Well, let me just cut. I might like the. Do I like the greenery? Or I have some other pages here that were on my table. Where are they? So 
sorry guys, just trying to find the pages. They're still here. Oh, I can't find them. Well, we'll try the greenery. I must have something else. I cut a whole lot out. No, I wanted something long. Here we go. That's what I want. That one. I think I might put, or I could have had that one. Mm, I might like that colour more. So I just do some very... I found my blue scissors. These are my favourite scissors. Well, fussy cutting. And I got them in a pack of scissors at Spotlight in Australia. I still have them. I had a look when I was there. It's a pack of blue scissors. They're, these, I like these. They're, they're very good. They swoosh around really fast. Okay. Want me to make some muffins after this, Lou? Yes, I'm starving. Mm, there you go. That was a a positive reply. I'm so hungry. Well, I won't be long. How did you be homeless, guys? No, I'll make them. Oh, no. I didn't say you had to make them. No, I know you've got to study. I need you to. No, no, you need to study. Yeah. She's got a surprise ish. A surprise-ish, is that correct, Lulu? Um, I don't want that. Let me just see what's here. A surprise-ish, um, you know, t interrogation tomorrow. They call it an interrogation here. It's like a, you know, question. She gets questioned in art history, and it's very a, lo a lot of stuff, a lot. It's all the Greek stuff. What what is it? Um, what do you have to do in your when you get asked tomorrow, Lou? Oh, I don't know. She can't hear me. She's right next door and she can't hear me. I'm talking to her, but she, maybe she's put no. She hasn't put earplugs in because she's um. I can hear the music. Oh well, no answer. Oh, I like that. There we go. That's a nice way to decorate a page. Now, why is that not sticking down? Might not like might not like the um, old paper. Can you make chocolate chip muffins? Yes. Yeah. Okay, so what that's that. No, what, Lulu? Nothing. No, nothing. Okay. okay. Don't want to go over the top with the embellishing. So that's that. Then what else have we done? We've got that there. And I'm um, not going to do anything there. Nothing there. I don't think I'll do anything there. Let me see. Something might look nice. No. Aren't these wonderful? Oh, we did that. That's good. I like that. I'm happy with that. I might have to go through, and I love that. Now, did I want to put any, 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 anything there? Let's have a look in the scrap. Oh, a little piece of that there. I like to take off that bit up there. I like to take away the the ruffle so it lays flat. I'll put that there. Um, can I get enough glue on that? Yes, I can. Because, you know, it's a mushy surface now. It's not all, it's not a hard surface. That's good. Okay. Um, nothing there. I think that's, I just love those colours all together. 
on screen, yes. Probably a little bit off at the top. Uh, I think I'll leave all of that. Love that. Here's a bit more space. No, I don't. I don't know if I really want to mess around in case someone wanted to do something. I could put that there or over here. I just don't like to do too much. That's nice. What about here? See, that would be nice there, wouldn't it? But I need something just behind it. Um, so let me see what I've got going on here. I don't want anything too, too busy. I think I might, I might like her too. Just a minute. Lovely Renaissance portrait. glue up here that way you can see and I might put my fingers are sticky now Put it down here, I think. Yes. I'll just put that there. So we'll glue that down. And that is it. And then I'm going to put um, some, I'm going to print out some old letters and put those in there. And oh, look at that. I put one of those in there. I put that whole page in there. That page is wonderful. I don't know if I can part with it. Well, I might not be parting with it. Um, We'll decide that in the next video. I've still got a little bit more to do. It's nice and chunky. Um, nice and chunky. So let's just quickly do a recap. Put all of the tags and things in. I've glued that down there. 
done a little bit of embellishing here and there, not too much. Don't want to go over the top. A little bit of, I might add a little ruffle somewhere else, possibly. Or I think maybe I'd like a ruffle there. Let me just grab some ruffle. I'm just going to grab a random piece and I think I'll put it there. Yeah. Make it a little bit, even a bit more chunky. Just shoot it down the center. Oh, look at that mess there. Let's trim that off. there and you'll notice I put the other one up there so I put this one down here so it's not too much bulk in one area on one you know in one area okay got our little things in there I didn't put anything in the back because there it's very um, fragile that page Got that in there, decorated that. Um, I wonder if we need another tab. Could do. my finger there we go it's just a little tab there some Tim Holtz fabric um, we've got that belly band there pretty And then that is it. Okay, and then I just have to put something in there. I might do something there, I'm not sure. We'll think about that in the next video. Okay, so we're nearly done. I'm going to put this under some books. It needs to flatten a little bit. And then that's the cover, and I need to think about the closure as well. Oh, it's going to be really nice. And it can, I mean, you can, you can kind of get this and sort of, oh, it's quite stiff. I was going to say you can get it to sort of bend a bit, but it doesn't. But it does squeeze over the journal, you see? So that's pretty cool. I'm very happy with that. Why don't we tie it up with this string for the moment? That'll help it. I'm just going to tie it up with the string. And just so it will stay closed for a bit. There we go. Yeah, good. Okay, what fun. Okay, so that's that. We just did some finishing touches on the pages, one last journaling card, and then I will be back with the finished, with it all finished, really. Um, it's nearly done. So I hope you've enjoyed this series. I'd love to see photographs. If anybody, just contact me on Etsy. You can even send them on Etsy or contact me on Etsy and I'll give you my email. Um, some of you have sent me photographs of things you're doing, and I love that. And um, and I hope you're all well. So this will be going up on Friday. Today is Wednesday. And, um, and then we'll be on to the next thing. So thank you for watching. See you soon. Bye.